What's up guys? So we're on another local adventure. We are going to an Atlanta Braves game. Yup. We are huge Braves fans, especially this guy. Yes. And we're actually fairly close to the stadium. Thankfully, once the Braves moved, yeah. we're um, pretty close and we love coming to Braves games. There's actually a lot to do around the stadium. Yes. And we actually haven't been as much this year uh, compared to normal. So because we're, it's like our third game maybe all yeah. year. We used to go literally like 10 to 20 games a year or more. Yes, when we were dating, it was like nonstop. Yeah, we were crazy with it, but. <laughs> he also used to work for the Braves, fun yeah, fact. <laughs> that's kind of a part of mine and Megan's like falling in love and meeting story, um, which you'll have to go back and watch one of those videos. But that was at their old stadium at Turner Field, which is on the south side of Atlanta. Uh, in 2007, they moved up to the north side into Cobb County, which is just outside of the city. And honestly, it was an amazing move. It's been so lively. It's been so cool. They have this area called the Battery, which has concert venues, bars, restaurants, entertainment, all of these things and things to keep you active and and entertained throughout the year not even when the braves are here yeah it's a it's a really fun area um i've actually celebrated multiple birthdays there because yeah. they have a lot to do um and and so have a, a lot of our friends so yeah. it's a really fun place to visit it is and fun. shop around and then we also have truest park which is where the braves play and it is such a beautiful stadium it is it is it's a vast contrast to the stadium in boston that megan and i went to Yes. Fenway Park. And Truist is very new, very modern, and very exciting. They've got awesome things inside the stadium. Or There's a lot to do, and it's really exciting. So yeah, we're going to get to walk in. We're uh, parked in our special spot. It's only $5 parking right here. <laughs> it's a secret spot. It's the way to go, because typically parking can be like 30 40 bucks. We do have to walk, but it's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad. Um, and yeah, we'll show you guys the battery area, and uh, we'll make our way in. We were actually here on Friday with Megan's dad for a game against the Dodgers. Lucky enough, a mortgage lender that I work with gifted us these tickets for tonight and we're literally two rows back from the field so we're excited to be here for another Dodgers Braves game which will be a lot of fun and entertaining. We're gonna get to walk in and uh, we'll show you what we get into. Mm -hmm. On the jukebox, man, we can make a bop like Hanson. Try to throw a party in a mansion, strolling through the sky. I'm daydreaming all the time. Throw your caution to the wind. This is where it all begins. Yeah, I'm over the moon, and that's where I'm taking you to. Feel like it's Christmas in June. Celebrate everything new. Waiting on me, but I'm hitting the snooze. I'm floating on top in this hot air balloon. Won't you come to my world where I'm making the rules? Yeah, it's pretty magical. Uh, hey. Living in a daydream. Ooh, it's such a sweet thing. Sweet thing. Life on a big screen. It's such a beautiful scene. Yeah, that's right. Living in a daydream. Ooh, it's such a sweet thing. Sweet thing. Life on a big screen. It's such a beautiful scene. Living in a daydream. Living in a daydream. Yeah. Living in a daydream. Living in a daydream. Uh. Living in a daydream. Living in a daydream. Yeah. Living in a daydream. Living in a daydream. Yeah. Sun still shining, the sky still blue. It's a new day for me to make these moves. Look at how I make these dreams come true. Now look at the view. Go ahead and jump in the line. Blow out the candles, not open your eyes. It 
it was all just a dream, now we living it up We got more than enough, is you coming or what? I'm over the moon, and that's where I'm taking you to Feel like it's Christmas in June Celebrate everything new Waiting on me, but I'm hitting the snooze I'm floating on top in this hot air balloon Won't you come to my world where I'm making new rules? Oh, that's wonderful Living in a daydream such a sweet thing, sweet thing. Life on a big screen, it's such a beautiful scene. Yeah, that's right. Living in a daydream, oh, it's such a sweet thing, sweet thing. Life on a big screen, it's such a beautiful scene. Living in a daydream, living in a daydream. So we made it in from the Braves game. Unfortunately, it didn't go our way. The Braves got absolutely destroyed tonight. It was not good. From very start to finish, it just was all bad for us. Our friends Grayson and Jules met us at the game and we had such a good time with them. It's always fun being at the ballpark and Truist, like we said, it's just so beautiful. They have so many things to do to keep you entertained. The in-game entertainment is so awesome and we had really awesome seats. We were literally two rows from the field, which is so funny because at the Red Sox game earlier this summer, we were two rows from the field, and then we kind of had the same experience tonight at Truist. And those seats are just so awesome. So shout out Silverton Mortgage for offering those tickets to us and letting us go to the game because we loved it and we always love it. Megan and I were talking about the vast contrast in experiences going to Truist and the Battery versus our experience going to Boston and Fenway Park. It just feels like Boston is more of like a locals spot and it's like a local stadium. It's all just so historic and everything there, whereas Truist is all just so brand new and even the inside, the outside, all the stores and the shopping, it's just a total different experience And which what makes all the baseball stadiums around the country so cool. Megan and I have been to Dodger Stadium and that's a really cool and unique experience, probably one of the most beautiful views from the upper level that I've ever seen, just being able to see the hills in the background absolutely gorgeous. We've been to the Padre Stadium and that was really beautiful. We went to the Milwaukee Brewers. That was a unique experience. I've never seen a game inside a enclosed uh, arena before and that was the first time I've ever done that. And then I actually went out to the San Francisco Giants with my parents a long time ago and that was such a fun time. We were seeing Barry Bonds play and he was chasing Hank Aaron's record which was really unique. Definitely recommend going down to the Battery if you're coming into town. Even if it's not for a Braves game, the Battery is just a fun time. The PBR bar is cool. It's kind of like a country bar. They, they play country music and they do line dancing and things like that. They have a bull that you can ride in there. They also have Sports and Social, which has bowling. They have karaoke. They have different kinds of games. They also have a dueling piano bar down there. A bunch of really great restaurants. One of mine and Megan's favorite restaurants. It used to be called El Felix. It's called Super Rica now. And we love that place. It's so good. Highly recommend that. There's a few spots around Atlanta with that place. But yeah, just a really great spot. We walked into a few stores. They have this store called Threads, which has a bunch of unique game wear and stuff like that. They've got some boutiques down there. And then also the Atlanta Braves main store is actually really cool too. And they have a lot of great things in there. Meg actually bought a really awesome sweatshirt on Friday night when we were there with her dad. Something that's really cool about Truist, they have this section called the Monument Garden and it's actually kind of like a museum. It's unique because in the past at the Braves old stadium Turner Field it was a museum that you had to pay for to get in and check out all the National League pennant banners and kind of seeing all the history and the retired jerseys and the uh, pitchers and players that were in the Hall of Fame, things like that. Whereas now, it's just an open walking area right behind home plate that you can walk back there and learn about Hank Aaron and all the greats that have come through Atlanta and just the history. You know, they used to actually be the Boston Braves and then they were the Boston Doves 
and then the Bean Eaters, and then they moved to Milwaukee, and then they eventually moved to Atlanta in the 60s, and they've been here ever since. So we only have two World Series championships since they've been here in the 60s. One happening in 2021, which was just like an insane time. We're one out away! <laughs> one out away! One out away! One out away! Let's go, Brad! Let's go! Oh my gosh! Megan and I were fortunate enough to be able to go to the World Series Parade and that was so amazing. Right back around, right here, right now. Both feet on the clouds, right back around. We can't slow us down. Till the sun goes out, bring it right back around. Let it go around till it come around. You know the sun shine brighter when you let it out. Time to show the people what it's all about. From the rooftop, I'ma yell it out. Ooh, once you go and get the crew, everybody coming through. You know what we came to do. Yeah, don't act like you never knew. Good things coming threes, but I still do the deuce. Right back around, right here, right now. Both feet on the clouds, right back around. But you can't slow us down. Fall and baseball is just a thing here in Georgia because typically they're always playing in October and it's always fun going to the games when you're a little more bundled up, having your jackets on. They, they tend to always fail in October, which is really painful for me, but those are some of my best experiences though with my dad is he and I going to Braves playoff games and it being so cold and just so ex exciting and so intense the whole time. That's something that I've always associated fall with is Braves baseball just because it's kind of always been a thing since I was growing up. So it, it was a lot of fun. Thank you guys so much for following along on our day and night at the Braves game. Remember to like, subscribe, follow us on Instagram and TikTok. All the things. <laughs> All right, guys, we'll see you in the next one. <laughs>